Tim Miller is a former Secret Service agent. Tim, how serious is this? Jesse, uh, it, I never thought I'd see the day where the Secret Service needed protection in the White House grounds. Mm -hmm. right. And, uh, you know, as a German Shepherd owner, pretty much my whole life, uh, you recognize these dogs are powerful. Uh, and it, that's why we use them in law enforcement and in the military. And when they're trained, they're awesome. When they're not trained, they are a deadly weapon. They run 30 miles an hour. They have bite pressure. I've seen these dogs in action, and it's shocking to me that more than 20 Secret Service agents have been attacked or bitten, one knocked down. And you just got to ask yourself the question, who's more important here, the dog or the Secret Service agents willing to lay down their life to protect you? What would it be like working the White House detail with this thing on the loose? Well, you know, anybody that's been around a German Shepherd that's angry recognizes <laughs> immediately, I don't care, you're going to be afraid. You know, you're going to, you're going to have a, a cautious approach. But here's the real is issue, Jesse. That dog became a security threat, not just to the agents, but to others, because we know when a dog bites and draws blood, it, it's likely to do it again and again and again. And we saw it in this case. And, you know, quite frankly, my question was, you know, if there was a real security incident, are this, which I've been a part of, are, are the agents going to be more concerned with being attacked by the dog or someone coming over the fence? Uh, it's what crazy. What would be a worse scenario as a Secret Service agent on the Biden detail? Getting bit by his dog or witnessing him skinny dipping? <laughs> Well, I think they're co-equal. I do, I, I do think, Jesse, you know, the fact that this dog was in the area and able, again, to pounce, you know, it's, it's scary. So right. I'm glad it's over. Maybe they'll issue a pardon to right. Commander. <laughs> That's right. And now they're a cat family. <laughs> Unbelievable. Thank you so much. And thanks for your service. Thanks for having me, Jesse. Click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You won't get it anywhere else.